Hi, this is Stephen Paul West of I Found Something Beautiful, and today's episode has to do with staying in touch with those that you're working with. Now, I have an uh, Android phone, an HTC Evo, and I've seen a lot of people asking how to set up mail folders. And real quick, I'm going to show you how I set up mail folders on my HTC Evo uh, without buying the additional Yahoo services. Now, I have uh, several different domains here. I'll go ahead and open up my mail. So um, if you take a look here, I have all these different mails, Gmail, Yahoo, Hotmail, all of these. I haven't set them all up in here, but you can just say new account and add them. So here in Yahoo, if you take a look at my Yahoo, you can see that um, underneath the uh, menu under folders, I've got all of my folders that I, I've needed. Now, uh, people have been asking how to do this, and I'm going to show you real quick how to do this. There's two different ways, depending on whether or not you have a normal Yahoo account or if you have a business mail, and I'll show you both ways real quick. Okay, so going into your more info, let's say I didn't have folders set up in here. I go into settings, into my account settings. Uh, of course, there's my initial uh, Yahoo stuff. Here is the deal. You set it up for an IMAP protocol. Now, what this will allow me to do is when people make a purchase or buy a, a uh, print from me, is it drops it into the order folder. So I know, always know when I have work to do. It keeps me in contact with individuals. Michelangelo had his connections. Da Vinci had his connections. You as an artist need to maintain your connections if you're going to be a profitable artist. So uh, once I set that all up, now I had to set it up for imap.mail.yahoo.com twice because initially it didn't set up uh, and recognize, um, and then I said none. So uh, I set it up that way with none, I hit the next, and I set it up again with imap, and then I saved it. Now I went back after the fact, and I went ahead and adjusted the settings. This is the outgoing mail server. So the first setting is your incoming, and set it to imap. And once you get it set up for imap.mail.yahoo.com, um, then change it to SSL, and the port will automatically change. You hit the next, it'll go to outbound mail servers. Now, if you don't set this to SMTP, you're going to get error messages. It's going to say log and fail. You won't be able to send mail. You can only receive mail. So go back in here and change this for smtp.mail.yahoo.com. Set it for SSL again, so it'll go through the login process and that's how you get your mail folders. Now, um, uh, real quick, I'll, I'll drop out here to one of my uh, business accounts and uh, you'll see that the settings are similar but just a little bit different. And again, I have all of my folders in here as well. And um, so, and I'm not paying a premium cost to Yahoo or anything like that. I'm just using their basic service. So uh, you hit that, you go into your more settings. You probably already have your Yahoo set up, just you're missing your folders. So you'll hit your account settings. Um, Hit your next. There you go. Here's all your settings. You want imap.mail.yahoo. You want your server set up for SSL and your server port. If you take a look at your outgoing mail server for a business account, it'll be a little bit different. And yours could be even more different than mine. My outgoing mail server, if you look here, is smtp.bizmail.yahoo.com. And that is how you set up your mail folders. Now, one more quick caveat here. Once you have your mail folders set up, and you're using them like I do. Uh, okay, I cannot see anything that's in my mail folder that um, was already there. In other words, only if my mobile account moves it in through IMAP or out through IMAP can I see it. So if you have a folder that you need to keep current, what you'll have to do is pull the, the files out of it and then put them back in via your mobile phone and then you'll see that all your accounts are in there. And this is Stephen Paul West and I want to thank you for watching I Found Something Beautiful and today's episode had to do with uh, the artist who communicates with his people and I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, do an artist a favor and buy a print and that way my low inbox will ring too. Thank you much.